now. Look at the camera, look. Look, welcome back. Lads, the pressure I was under to choose a slatty shirt this morning was ridiculous. Knowing that these two fashionistas were with me. I'm not reading that, I'm just gonna kiss the baba. <laughs> <laughs> Look at her. Well, yes, I better take over here. Karen yeah, Coster has been hosting down, we... Style and Celebrity Bible Expose since yeah. its inception in yeah. 2007. And now the show New is giving people. its viewers access to yeah. all of the fashion and beauty news you need live at the Expose yeah. Style sessions on the 21st of October. Karen girl. joins us now with the newest member of the Expose <laughs> team. You'll say hello, this chicken. Eve. That's Eve. Yeah, Karen, that's... I'm, I'm sorry to yeah. tell you, it's not about you today. <laughs> it's all, all about right. her. This is about this oh. little bundle of gorgeousness. Look she at her. Look at How old are we? She is three months, three and a half. She'll be four months on the 8th of October. She's looking over at her brothers. Yeah. Look. Oh, oh, yeah. Look, I couldn't get a babysitter. Sorry. I just had to bring them all with all right. me. Is that You're, okay? Listen, the last time I was here, I was holding him in my arms. <laughs> yeah, I know. JJ was only 12 JJ days old. JJ was only equal. Weren't you, JJ? Oh, and now he's big. Look, look at him, him now. now. He's a big boy now. Two big, big boys. I know, two big brothers, so and she'll she never have a boyfriend. She can't take her eyes off him, look. I know. Look. Oh, it's a busy she's house. So cute. She's saying, Do you know what, Karen? The, the one thing okay, better okay, than okay, seeing, okay, seeing okay. you from our viewers' point of view is seeing oh. Karen's kids. Oh, yeah. good. No, I can only imagine if you're going to. Well, it's funny because I was like, Finn yeah, and JJ, do you want to come and see the big yeah. cameras? And they were very excited about that. And then they were watching the show earlier and they were like, well, where's the couch we're going to sit on? Because you were over at the other set. Yeah, so yeah. we feel yeah. better we got the couch, don't we? We feel so very important. Let's get the uh, business of the day sorted. Yes. What's happening at the Castlenock Hotel, the lovely Castlenock Hotel? The lovely Hotel. four star Castlenock Hotel. So it's the Expose Style Coming Sessions. Over. He wants Jump a microphone up. of his own. Yeah, um, he's right. The Expose Style Sessions are happening on the 21st of October. Very good. So it's a lovely girly day out. I'm really looking forward to it because I'm missing a bit of girliness and glam. Because um, uh, you're still officially on your maternity I leave, am. right? Yes. yes. So I'm kind of there just representing the show, myself and Cassie. Glenda will be hopefully sitting with her feet up, having Rob bring her tea as she awaits her due date. Um, so it's a big gold girly day out, arrive, have some bubbles, have afternoon tea, enjoy a fashion show and styling sessions with Lorna nice. Waitman, who you'll know from Exposé, and Trina McCarthy will be yeah. there as well. I know! That's you! Me. Yeah. Don't always look like that, do I, JJ? So, a great girly, old, a girly day out, so it's 11 to 4. Come from half nine, because there'll be a nail bar open with complimentary manicures. So it's going to be a great day. So and a lovely gets day. To have a day of to mommy, mommy gets to indulge well, you're in some girliness. Well, working that day, really. Kind of. It's, yeah. It doesn't feel like work with that, and it's a great opportunity for us to actually meet our viewers because we don't get to, you know. So yes. it'll be lovely to, you know, go and say hi to everyone. And, and it is important for mums as well as non-mums, oh, I suppose, yeah. to gather together and have yeah. a day where you just escape from yes, the madness of absolutely. home. Absolutely. Yeah. So yeah. I'm really looking forward to it. So yeah. It's Tell us great. the boys. What ages are the boys now? They're big, I, aren't they? Finn, you can speak for yourself. What age are you, Finn? Three. Three. And JJ, what age are you? Two. Two. Finn, can I ask you a question, Finn? Who's your favourite football team? Mm. Don't look over at your dad. Well, see, Finn has just started football himself. So oh, good, good, say good, the good. The Donnybrook good. Football Academy is yes, his favourite. Yes, well, of course, yeah. Yes. Well, that's OK. You're allowed to say that. Da, yeah. Da, 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 da. Cool. Da, yeah, da, they're brilliant da. boys, I have to say. This is so unusual having the little... Because we have seven boys between the two. Between us, yeah. Not a sight of a girl Look, it's a baby us. girl. It's such a this is what they it's look like. really loud. Mine is really, really loud. loud. So I can't yes. imagine if there was another male voice added to it. Do you, it's do you notice chaos. big difference now in terms of as babies, boys, girls? No, do you know what? No? And All I the think same? the fact that I have, or we have uh, three kids pretty close in age is testament to the fact of what good babies they actually were. Yeah. Like, not that yeah. they slept through the night at an early age, but... They had good temperaments, you know, they yeah. weren't massively colicky or anything like that. Yeah. So, in fairness, she's following suit. Finn was a really good baby, JJ was a really good baby. Yeah. So she's nice and chilled. But they, they're also chilled because of their environment, Karen. Do you know what I mean? I and the more so. relaxed you are as parents, and I think you do get more relaxed as you go, don't you, John? He's kind yeah. of half nodding. <laughs> John's That's asleep over relaxed. the stairs over there. <laughs> He's getting a quick kip in. Um, I do think, though, they pick up on your mood, I don't they? I so, yeah. I mean, we try and be relaxed. I mean, with your first... Like, even last night, I was saying, I nearly wish you could have your third baby first because yes. I'm such a different mom. I think, because, you know, you're Googling everything. You're kind of... You're taking note of, how long did I feed on the right boob? How long did I feed... The... Like, all yeah, this crazy I stuff know. that you just... You're kind of looking at her going, has she fed now? Oh, God, when did I last change her nappy? Like, it's so yeah. different, isn't it? I mean, so what I can only... think of the story we were talking about earlier on about the, the girl being sent the photograph of the mother-in-law and wearing this dress to the wedding? What did you think no, of that? Did you see that photograph, Karen? It looks like a wedding dress. Doesn't it? Ah, uh, no, you it's, can't be upset. There's the dress the there. That's got to be a wind-up, hasn't it? Uh, completely. I do think the one piece of etiquette, and I know my mother-in-law, Mary Maguire, she wanted to make sure that mum had chosen 
what colour she was going to wear to the right, wedding. Right. So yeah. I think that's nice if the mums can kind of decide, OK, if you, the mother of the bride can choose what colour she's going to be in and then the mother-in-law, uh, yeah. the mother of the groom gets second choice. That's just, that's not on. That's not It's kind of bonkers, isn't it? Totally. Yeah. Which it's is what make, it was making us think it must be a wind-up. I hope so. kind of <laughs> feels very Oh, no, don't be given out. <laughs> oh, she's what confused. are you giving out she's for? The attention's gone off her, so she's giving out. What are you she's giving out so for? Gorgeous. She's very good girl. She's the best girl for me. Sit up there now. Have He's nice and edge. comfy and squashy, yeah. isn't he? I'm like a big old pillow, am I? Like, <laughs> huh? Karen, I'm like a big we've old lots pillow. of footage um, of you interviewing lots of different stars. Yeah, You're on your maternity yeah. leave. Yeah. I don't necessarily want to bring you back into work more. mode. What? Yeah. But <laughs> what do I do again? Yeah, but are there moments that really stand out for you in terms of interviewees? In terms of well, surreal moments where you kind of feel yeah. like you need to pinch yourself? Well, because I'm such a baby born now, if I get to meet another mom, particularly, you know, I mean, I think all mums work really hard but another mum that is trying to have a career and juggle that, um, that's kind of, you know, ticking all the boxes for me. So Victoria Beckham was yes. a cool one. Can, am I even being coherent with these monkeys? Yes, she she calling all yeah. over me? Yeah, no, you what are. She, yeah, like? yeah. she, she like? was, you know the way people go, oh, she's so funny. And you're like, yeah, right, she never smiles. She actually is really funny in the flesh. Is and she? So nice and engaging and really warm. I kind of thought she'd be a little bit more of an ice maiden, but just lovely and you know, dropping in the names of the kids. Like, the, it felt like there was nothing off limits, even though it was a pretty controlled interview, you know, yes. in terms of what you can ask and what you couldn't. You definitely felt like you could still kind of go there and probe a little bit, you know? Yeah. And she's what a, are you doing? like, what a success story, like, to build that brand. She's unreal. From nothing to that. Like, it's a multi, multi-million dollar business. Yeah, yeah. she just celebrates uh, 10 years of her of That's Victoria right. Beckham yes. brand. So it just and shows. she's kind of poking fun at herself in that Vogue video and everything. So she, you know, I think she's getting she's lighter. She's kind of a dry sense of humour, doesn't she? She does. From time to time. It's interesting how much she actually, because this is something, I don't know if you guys feel the same, but like how much of her kids she shows now on social media, because yeah, that's something yeah. I kind of struggle with. Yeah. And actually, Catherine Thomas is brilliant during the week. She said, yeah, I show my kids off on social media because I'm so pr proud kids, of sorry, them. I'm so proud of my daughter. And yes. that's yeah, yeah. kind of how I feel. Like, you don't want to kind of, you know, put too much of them up, but you just can't help yourself sometimes. But sometimes you're just bursting you're with pride when you bursting. see a picture yes. of them. Yeah. It, so helps, it, it helps that. Victoria as well, but you can drag your man along to a photo shoot as well. Yeah, man. It? Like, he's a bit photogenic, isn't he? <laughs> yeah. Remember yeah. him at the Royal Wedding? The eye, all right. At the Royal Wedding during the summer, do you remember? Uh, there was more focus on him than there was. I, I said, John, they're like us at every wedding we've gone to. They've clearly had a fight on the way there, because I don't know a couple <laughs> that doesn't yeah, fight on the way to a wedding, because... Because you're normally late. Well, you're normally late getting there. Yes. Always late. Always, always, always late. miss the entrance. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Always. It's very stressy, actually, isn't it? Going to weddings. Oh God. Yeah, uh, actually, the, so the right least stressed I ever was was going to my own. Your and own I figured wedding. out because John was nowhere there. He yeah. was at the church. He was someone else's yeah, problem, yeah, yeah. and I got to just look after <laughs> was myself. Else. I was Finn, early. Finn, Don't be touching Finn, that. Don't be touching that. You know who's dying to meet you is Louise, who looks after the sound. Yeah. yeah I know. Sorry, Louise. Louise. Don't sorry, Louise. Sorry, Louise. Sorry. And Karen. She's dying to be here. Last week we <laughs> saw the celebration of, of TV3, the 20 years. I was glued. The new, it was brilliant. I was glued as well. Yeah, I loved it. But it did remind me that you were, you are the only original Expose member. Am I right? Yes. Yeah, you are, look. yeah, yeah I'm hanging look on in there. Ha look at the baby. What did you oh, feel so when, you, when you look at that out. footage? Don't like, be giving out to me. Like that... I want yeah. to say to her, it it's actually even going to be better than I you think know. right there. Aww. I mean, I was so excited that day. There was so much hype around the show. The girls were brilliant. That's the first day I met Lisa. We just clicked straight away. And actually, it, you know, everyone kind of doubted it and was like, how are you going to fill half an hour yeah. every day? Um, and I was just so positive and optimistic. I was like, of course we're going to do this. And I was working with Debbie O'Donnell, who'd been my producer in Ireland, so I wasn't worried. And actually, it's given me more opportunities and been such a success. And, you know, we're 11 it's years been a now. So success. it turned out even better than I thought it was going yeah, to. It's, it's a, a household household this one. Huh? Bit of a dancer, this she one. She is going to do river dance. Look at her. <laughs> she I never have a stops. Hold you can have a little, a little hold, hold, but I want yes. her back in a minute. And you know, I thought with the girl, oh, she's going to be so light. The delivery is going to be so easy. She's she my third your biggest baby. Biggest baby, nine, nine four, four. Hello, toughest one. She's and not biggest baby. She was the yeah. biggest baby. Not anymore. Baby. She's yeah, not. She was not. Who's the biggest now? Look at her. You are. So oh, you're my um, biggest. If you want to nab tickets for the Expo yes. style sessions on the twenty first of October. In the Castle Knock Hotel, log on to eventbrite.ie. If you ask her nicely, Karen might even post for herself. Oh, she's stop. very awkward about she's stuff like that. I promise not to bring all three children as well. <laughs> I'm sorry if Karen, I didn't thank get you for any sense. Thank you for having us. Thank, thank you, thank you baby girl. Thank, thank you, baby girl. Bye. 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 Look at the red light, right, that after one. After break, Bye. we'll be heading over to the RDS where Laura is live in the Antiques Fair. See you soon. Bye. High five, guys.